Hi Leo, welcome to your weekly love reading and extended on Patreon. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for subscribing to my channel. I appreciate your love and support. Please bear in mind that this is a general reading and it may not resonate with each and every one of you. Time and energy is fluid, so this reading could resonate with you in the past, currently, or in the future. All right, Leo, let's get your reading started. Spirits and angels, please show me important, accurate love messages for Leo for this week. Four Pentacles. Okay, Leo. Let's take a look. It's got the Queen of Wands in reverse. This could be your energy, Leo, Sagittarius, um, Aries. You could also be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, um, or somebody like your sign, Scorpio. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, don't take any, any of these fixed signs here as well. Don't take any of the signs too seriously as well. Leo, we all could embody any of this energy. Um, but what I'm seeing here is that someone is stalking. Okay, <laughs> Page of Swords right here. Uh, someone is stalking the third party. That's what I'm getting. Someone is stalking. It could be you or your person to see if they are happy in this relationship, in their relationship. I do sense that it's a third party situation going on with the Three of Swords here. So um, I'm sensing someone... <laughs> With the Seven of Wands here, it's almost like someone standing their ground, okay? Um, also, trying to be strong, that's what I'm getting. Someone here is trying to be really strong, but actually they are at the verge of giving up, letting go, because it's too exhausting, and this heartbreak is very, very exhausting. Or third party situation is very exhausting, but I do see someone here watching. The Queen of Wands in reverse here, what because I do read the Queen of Wands as the third party, the other woman or the other man, but doesn't mean it's you. Again, just take what resonates with you, but it does look like someone is trying to, um, someone is uh, spying on the third party to see how they are doing with their person, okay? If they are happy or not in that relationship. But the moon is right here, so it indicates a lot of uncertainty. Leo, you could be feeling very uncertain when it comes to your love situation, um, some fears and insecurities as well. And hoping with the two of wands here, feeling at a crossroad, um, trying to make a choice here, looking into your future. But guess what, Leo? Uh, what I'm seeing here right now is that there could be a new beginning with the ace of wands here, okay, for you. Um, it could be a new beginning in love, okay? Someone you are very passionate about, that you will be passionate about. If you haven't met this person yet, it looks like a new person is coming in. If you've already met this person and you think this is the one that you are very attracted to, uh, it looks like things are going to change. There'll be a lot of um, messaging, it looks like, back and forth between you and your new person here. And also, Wheel of Fortune does indicate that finally luck is going to be on your side. But Four of Pentacles is still here, so it does look like someone may be holding on or holding back. Um, could also be an indication of fear of letting somebody come into their life or into their heart. Let me see. Two of Pentacles is here as well. So there's some uncertainties going on, indecisiveness. King of Swords in reverse, still feeling very vengeful or holding grudges towards somebody in the past who could have been disloyal, okay, non-committal with the King of Wands in reverse. Strength is in reverse. Also, I'm sensing, Leo, this is your energy actually. So in reverse, you know, I do see that you might have some fear, insecurities, um, about your future, right? Your future in love. But what I'm seeing here is that there is somebody new coming in for you. So um, I guess with the strength card here, it's turn it upside down instead, okay? Patience is virtue. That's what I'm getting as well. Um, and, and divine timing with the view of fortune, it also indicates in divine timing, this new passionate love will 
begin and uh, or will blossom if you're already with your person a new person looks like it's going to blossom but what i'm seeing here that is with the past situation for some of you who could be dealing with somebody in your past this could also be your person okay you can switch the character around but it does look like your person could feel um feel conflicted okay with the two of ones here feeling conflicted feeling they're at a crossroad feeling like they need to make a choice here or your person could be watching you instead because queen of ones this could be your energy too so your person could be checking up on you keeping tabs on you as well to see what you're up to okay so there is also some resistance here with the seven of ones perhaps if both of you on communicating right now or you know not in good terms it looks like there's a resistance um on their part but again it could go vice versa so it doesn't matter it doesn't matter king or queen okay don't take these signs to uh, again seriously it's i mean the gender it's not specific but i do see here leo that ten of ten of pentacles i uh, sorry ten of one ten of cups is in reverse here so it does indicate a separation between you and your person okay but i do see with the nine of pentacles here it looks like someone is going to possibly choose to embrace their singlehood and wait for the divine timing to happen with the new person now, i'm sensing for some of you you have again have already met this person and you the love will blossom into something i feel like something very exciting as well you and your person could be this new person could be at a distance you know you could be communicating a lot on whatsapp or you know messaging each other a lot um for some of you you could also have met this person not all of you uh, online okay with dating app online um that sort of stuff but leo let's go to, um let's find out in the extended reading for you okay let's find out what's going on um because it does look like someone here is checking up on the third party so let's find out if that's the case um let's find out what's going on between your person and the third party okay what what is going on with them um how are they connecting with each other and also let's find out how does your past person currently feel about you what are their true intentions and most likely outcome we're just going to reconfirm it um but what i'm seeing here also leo for some of you you will be meeting somebody new so let's see what is the potential with this new person okay um yeah so we're gonna open more cards and we're gonna dive deeper into your reading also get you some advice with the romance angels oracle okay leo so the link is in the description box below you can just click on it and it will bring you to my patreon page and it's only ten dollars for all the weekly love reading okay not not everything but the ten dollars is just for the weekly extended reading but um if we resonated with this reading please hit like share and subscribe and if we part ways here please take care and also leo i hope to see you at the extended if not back here on my youtube channel take care leo bye